It's Todd, and I am here in Jinja, Uganda, with Edith and Patrick. Edith runs Home of Hope in Jinja. Patrick has been here for two years. He is a six-year-old boy. He has cerebral palsy, and he is being very well cared for here at Home of Hope. So Edith, can you tell us a little bit more about Patrick and yes. his story? Patrick was abandoned in Entebbe. Uh, before that, Patrick was with his mother, and his mother was HIV positive. So she passed on. But uh, when she passed on, because uh, she used to take her to a, a hospital where they do exercise with the children, help them to see how they can improve. So when she passed on, the person who took care of uh, Patrick just decided to abandon Patrick uh, across the road close to the police in Entebbe. And here is when the police uh, contacted a, a certain place which took care of Patrick temporarily for the week as they were looking for a place where he had to go. And when they transferred Patrick here, they had done all the assessment, the blood test, and they found that he had HIV positive. So they started putting in on him on a medication, and they transferred him here with his medication, whereby as homophobic, we also continue to do the same. So when we did the same, the great thing with Patrick is that after six months at homophobic with his medication, they went to test back when he had no, he was HIV free. He was HIV free and we kept on just going for a review tests and there's nothing showing that he's HIV positive. So as you see Patrick, he has severe cerebral palsy, but as home, as home of hope, we are trying to do exercise with him, take care of them, feed, take care of him, feeding him so well. And we can see that even if he's so small, but he looks healthy because he eats well, he drinks well, and there's much, much improvement according to the situation he, he came in. So we are grateful that right now we don't know any of uh, Patrick's family, but we are really taking care of him and he's really a good boy and doing well. So he makes me happy. <laughs> yes, thank you so much. So Edith, right now you have 63 children here yes. at Home of Hope. Yes. Wow. So you're caring for a lot of people. I'm caring for a lot of people, that's yes. true. Yes, and they all get good care. They all get good yes. care. The staff are doing a great job. Yes. yes. Children are happy which is really good. Yeah, yeah. Well, thank you for all that you're doing.